Yo, what's going on everyone? In this video, we will be finding all of the hidden butterfly chests in Hogwarts Legacy. So without further ado, let's get started. So at Hogsmeade in the Three Broomsticks, there is an NPC that will give us this quest in which we will find hidden butterfly chests. So for the quest that she will give us, which is follow the butterflies, we will find it over here in the Forbidden Forest. The chest is somewhere around here. But first we have to find the butterflies in order for the chest to appear. So select the Forbidden Forest Flu Flame to fast travel. Once we arrive, turn to the right and cross this bridge. And then we, we should use our broom to travel because it's much faster. Then we just follow the path over here and we find the butterflies. Now that we have found the butterflies, we can now go and find the location of the hidden chest. Well, we've come this far. This one we just follow this path, and ahead of us should be the location of the hidden butterfly chest. It's right over here on this flower patch. So on to the next butterfly chest location. We will be referencing Hogsmeade, and to the west of Hogsmeade, over in this river right here, as we zoom in, put a marker over there, and... We shall select this flu flame, East North Hogwarts region, to fast travel over there. So as we arrive, we look behind to where our marker is placed. We ride our broom and head over to our marker. As we approach 100 units from the marker, we can use our value so we will know the location of the butterflies. So once we've seen it, activate the butterflies, they will start moving. So now this will enable us to open the chest in this flower patch right here. On to the next butterfly location, we will be referencing Hogsmeade. And from Hogsmeade, we move over to this area over here. Let's zoom in and move slightly to the left as long as you can see this path over here and once you see that path mark it because that's where the butterfly will be now you can choose jackdaw's tomb and fast travel once we arrive we look to our right and across is just our marker now let's summon our broom and ride over the lake once we get near the marker, let's activate Revelio so that we can spot Revelio. the butterflies much faster. And just ahead of us are the butterflies. Let's move closer to activate it. Once we activated the butterflies, let's head over this path and we shall find an abandoned house with a flower Someone patch beside it. So just right over here, use Revelio to find the chest. Now back to the map, we will be referencing Hogsmeade and from Hogsmeade we will be moving up to the north just right here in Pit Upon Ford and let's zoom in and place a marker right over here. Now that we've done that, select Pit Upon Ford Flu Flame to fast travel. As we arrive, look to our left where the marker is placed. Now let's ride our broom to make it over there faster. And once we're near the area, use our value to see where the butterflies are at. Once we found the butterflies, let's go near them to activate them. And once they start moving, we can now head over to the location of the hidden chest. Just go past this wooden bridge onto these trees right here. Then onto this area here where there is a waterfall. And there's a flower patch here that will have the hidden chest. Rebellion. Now on to the map. Let's go to Hogsmeade for reference. And from Hogsmeade, let's go to the east, which is right over here. Let's zoom in and let's place a marker right over here. And once you place a marker, select Hogsmeade East Valley Flu Flame. Once we arrive, let's go outside of the house. Let's summon our broom and move over to the location of the marker. Once we're near, use Revelio to see the location of the butterflies. 
Once you've seen the butterflies, approach the location to activate the butterflies. Once that's done, let's head over to the location of the hidden chest. Over in this cliff here, there will be a flower patch. Use Revelio to reveal the chest. Now on to the map. Let's go to Hogwarts for reference. And to the west of Hogwarts, there is a small area over here. Let's zoom in. And as you can see, over this area here, just put a marker there. And now, fast travel to this flu flame right here, the Moon Calf Den. As we arrive, look to the right and summon our broom. Then we move towards the marker's location. Once you're near the marker, Rebellion. use Revelio to find the butterflies. Approach the butterflies to activate the hidden chest location, which is right over here in this flower patch. So let's go back to the map. We'll reference Hogwarts and we move east, just right over here on this flu fame, Aaron Char. So now, the butterfly is over here. Mark that location on the map. Now select the Aronshire flu fame to fast travel. Once we've arrived at Aronshire, look to the right and ride our broom and let's move over to the location of our marker. Once we're near the marker, activate Revelio to find the butterflies. Let's move closer to the butterflies to activate the hidden chest. The hidden chest is right over here between the two cliffs and this flower patch right here. Now let's open up the map and we'll reference Hogwarts. Let's move a little bit south of Hogwarts right over here in this flu flame. Just to the right side of it, there is a butterfly here. Let's mark it on the map. And now let's fast travel. Once we've arrived, let's go outside of the house and then ride our broom. Let's head over to the marker's location Rebellion. and use your value to find the butterflies. Once we approach the butterflies, let's move over to this hill right here. And there should be a flower patch where the hidden chest is located. Let's open up our map again and go back to Hogwarts for reference. Then let's move to the south part, right over here. This flu flame called North Feldcroft. So now from North Feldcroft flu flame, mark this location over here. There will be a butterfly. Once we arrive, let's turn to our right and then let's ride our broom and head over to the marker's location. Once we are near, let's activate Revelio and approach the butterflies. After doing that, let's head over down this cliff right here. Let's turn to the left a little bit and right over here, there should be a flower patch where the hidden chest is located. Let's open up the map and we'll go back to Hogwarts for reference. And let's head down right over here in this flu flame. The Feldcroft Catacomb. Now let's zoom in and the butterfly's location should be right over here. Let's mark it on the map and now let's fast travel to the Feldcroft Catacomb. Once we arrive, let's look at the flu flame, then summon our broom, then we fly over to the cliffs. Just because we can easily you. see the butterflies right over in this location. Once you've approached the butterflies, just fly up here. There will be a flower patch. And then you can use your value. Now let's open up the map. Let's go to Hogwarts for reference. Let's go south. 
just over here. Let's zoom in. And just west of Keenbridge, right over here. Let's put a marker right there. Then let's fast travel to the Keenbridge Foo Flame. Once we arrive, let's use our broom and head over to the marker's location. Once we're near the marker, Rebellion. let's use Revelio. Now that we can find the butterflies, let's approach it. After approaching the butterflies, let's head over to the flower patch to the location of the hidden chest. Now let's go back to the map. Let's head over to Hogwarts for reference. Then we go south, just right over in this castle right here and place a marker just on the river, just like I did. Now let's fast travel to the Foo Flame right over here, to the Mind's Eye. Once we've arrived, let's summon our broom and head over to the Foo Flame's location. Now that we're near the marker, let's use Revelio to find the butterflies much quicker. Approach the butterflies to activate the hidden chest location. Now let's head over to the location of the hidden chest right over here between the trees and just past this cliff. There will be a flower patch right over here. Now let's open up the map. Let's go back to Hogwarts for reference. Now we go south of Hogwarts right over here. The Poidseer Castle Flu Fame. Now just across of the Flu Flame, we will find the butterflies. They are right over here. Mark it on the map. And now let's fast travel to Poidseer Castle. Once we've arrived, let's summon our broom and move over to the location of the marker. Use Rebellion. your value once we're near the location. And once we've found the butterflies, let's approach them. Let's look over behind us. And we head straight in this path. We will go directly to the location of the hidden chest. It should be right around here, near this cliff. There we go. Now we can use our value. Now for our 14th chest, this will be the easiest. Let's go back to Hogwarts for reference. Then let's move south, right over here in this blue flame. South points your coast. Now we zoom in. The butterflies will be just outside the house once we fast travel into the foo flame. Once we have arrived, let's look to the left. There will be a door. Let's head outside. Then let's summon our broom. Then just Rebellion. right beside us, there will be the butterflies. So once you found the butterflies, let's approach them. Once the butterflies start moving, let's head over to the hidden chest location. We will find the flower patch just beside this abandoned building. Now let's open up the map. Let's go back to Hogwarts for reference. And as we get to Hogwarts, let's move down to the south. Let's keep moving down. right over here let's zoom in and let's place the marker right over here now that's where our butterfly will be there are multiple flu flames that will help you get to that butterfly's location but for this tutorial's sake i will use bane burr select bane burr flu flame and fast travel sure how I'd fare once you've arrived at like bane burr summon your broom and let's move over to the location of the marker Let's fly above the waters to maintain the speed boost of the broom. We will then head over and take the high path. We'll go over these cliffs. And once we've done that, let's Rebellion. use Revelio. 
I mean, let's use Ravelio further ahead. The butterflies should show. They're right over there. Approach the butterflies to activate the hidden chest's location. We will be heading there shortly. Let's just follow this path and pass these Ashwinder eggs. There's a flower patch that will contain the hidden chest. Congratulations on finding all 15 of the hidden butterfly chests and enjoy your adventures in the wizarding world.